everybody, welcome back to the Evermore YouTube channel. It's Chris Pat with the Rumour Has It video where we're talking about players linked to the club. And this transfer window is wide open now, so there's going to be a lot more names being linked over the next few weeks. And I think there'll be a few sign-ins on the board as well. So just before we do a little bit of housekeeping, if you can, if you like this kind of thing, please click that like and subscribe button. We'd love you to come and join us. Get me teeth right there. We're on 2021 subscribers, so loads more room for you guys. We don't do ITK here. We just do who's linked in the media, talk a little bit about the player, have a look at his stats with Mark Super Duper Stat Computer, and then we'll get your comments as well. So let's get stuck in there. What kind of player are we talking about now? We're talking about a defender, and uh, this player has been linked through a few media sources. And it's this young lad here who is uh, Ivan Fresneda, who is a, a, a young twenty, well, a young right back, 18-year-old right back, um, who is a Spanish international, came through the uh, Real Madrid Youth Academy, and then he uh, fucked off to uh, Real Valladolid. And he's been there since 2021. Now, he's a very talented player, this lad. Got loads of pace. Loves a trick as a right back as well. Um, pretty strong on the ball too. Um, doesn't get knocked off the ball easy. Good positional sense as Mark's got there. Tackling and key passes of his strength. Weaknesses-wise, aerial duels and ball retention he's got there. But he has got a bit of a trick. He likes a bit of a trick. He sometimes gets caught in position. But just looking at the lad's stats in terms of you know how he does per 90 minutes, you can see there from a tackling perspective, he's right up there. Um, you know, and right back in the top five leagues in Europe. So he's tackling, he's doing 3.7 more tackles a game. Of course, playing for Real Valadid, you'll be under a little bit more pressure and you would be maybe a Real or a Barcelona. But he's in the 99 percentile. Interceptions, he's in the 93 percentile. He's very, very clever at getting his body in the way of the ball, nicking in front of the attacker, winning the ball. So it's a, it's a real talent to have as a right back. Blocks, he's maybe a little bit lower on that. So he's, he's not getting himself in the way of the ball, so to speak, but he is nicking the ball off the attacking player, which is a very good thing to have as a right-back. Clearances, he's on the 98 percentile. That shows the kind of pressure for the leader probably under. His passing-wise, his pass completion is up in the 62 percentiles. That's not too bad. Crosses-wise, 53 percentile. So a little bit lesser than Kieran Trippier, but Kieran Trippier crosses more than, uh, I think, uh, a vampire hunter, to be honest with you, because he's that bloody good. Um, but looking at the lad, you know, 18 years old, he's got some real promises, there's no doubt about that. He's playing in a really tough league in La Liga, in a tough position. You know, he's made that jump from Real Madrid to Valladolid, and he's, he's doing really, really well. He's, he's represented Spain in the under-18, under-19 levels, so uh, I think he's very much a player that, you know, has potential to to go on and, and be even better. You know, there is other clubs linked to him. Uh, Juventus and Arsenal apparently are both interested in the lads. He's had 10 appearances so far for by the lead. No goals, no assists. Um, how does he compare to the Super Duper Kieran Trippi? You can see on the side there, he does best Kieran in some some areas. I think more kind of um, tackles and interceptions. Uh, or he's just on par on the interceptions there. Uh, but obviously Trippi would beat him on everything else, but you'd expect that. For a lad who's nearly twice his age and got loads of experience, but you know similar players to to uh, Fresneda, you know in terms of, of of what they offer their side, you can see there, you know, likes of uh, Matt Target is on there as well, so a similar game to Matty Target, um, but obviously you know on the right hand side rather than left hand side. So yeah, Fresneda could be a really good sign, and, and the, the reported fee is only ten million quid, which I think is a pretty Decent little bit of business, really. Now, as an 18-year-old lad, you know, he's got loads of potential. Eddie Howe is the right manager to get potential out of these young players. So let us know what you guys think in the comments below where you think Fresneda would be a good signing for us going forward. You know, we are still linked to Harrison Ashby as well from West Ham. That That is still kicking around in the background. I don't even think that's got a transfer fee. So depending on what Eddie Howe thinks and what he rates between these two players, do you drop 10 million quid on a lad who's playing in La Liga and doing quite well? Or do you take a kid on a free, um, you know, from the under-23s who's had a couple of first-team snits at West Ham? It's all up to Eddie Howe, you know, and who, who are us to doubt Eddie Howe in terms of his ability and, and thoughts as a football manager? But there's going to be loads of players linked to the club this this uh, month. We're going to do our best to bring as many of you, many of them to you as we can. <laughs> Get my teeth right there. Um, but yeah, there'll be a few that are duffs and there'll be a few that are going to kick off as well. But it should be heating up, I think, in the next couple of weeks. So keep it ever more, guys. As I mentioned at the start, if you haven't already, smash that like and subscribe button. Come and join us. We'll have loads of pop-up transfer videos like this in the, for the rest of the month, as well as the two weekly shows every Monday and every Wednesday. But until then, let's keep supporting our team of Coin United. This is Chris signing off, and we'll catch you later. Cheers.